In 2019, the number of highly qualified immigrants, that's academics with a job guarantee and minimum salary, continued to increase. Most went to Bavaria. Last year, more highly qualified people immigrated to Germany with the EU blue card than in the previous year. This was announced by the Federal Office for Migration and Refugees. According to this, a total of 31,220 people who do not have EU citizenship came to the Federal Republic of Germany using a blue card in 2019. That was 14.6% more than in the previous year. Since the introduction eight years ago, the number of applications with the EU blue card has been increasing steadily, said Andrea Schumacher, Vice President of the Federal Office. Germany is clearly ahead in terms of popularity among the EU countries. Since the introduction of the blue card, the Federal Republic has always accounted for more than 82% of the grants. The European Union's blue card grants temporary residence and employment rights for highly qualified foreigners if they have a university degree, a job guarantee in Germany and a certain minimum income. It was introduced in Germany in 2012. In 2019, a quarter of all blue cards were issued to Indian citizens. People from China, Russia and Turkey followed. However, only about every fourth blue card goes to a woman. Most academics migrated to Bavaria with 21.3%, followed by Baden-Württemberg with 16.2%, North Rhine-Westphalia, my home state, with 15.8%, and Berlin with 14.7%. Anyone who has lived and worked in Germany for at least five years can also obtain a permanent residence permit. According to the Federal Office, around 2,400 people took advantage of this opportunity last year. That was almost 20% more than in the previous year. According to the Federal Office for Refugees and Migration Numbers, the number of residence permits in research for students and employees of companies operating in Germany continues to rise. The move of skilled workers to Germany is a declared goal of the federal government. The lack of skilled workers was defined, among other things, by the Federal Employment Agency as a crucial obstacle to growth. If you now want to know more about European politics from a German point of view, YouTube has chosen another of my videos right here for you in the end screen, right next to your chance to subscribe to my channel. If you use that, don't forget to click the bell so you always will be notified when I publish a new video. I'll see you in my next video. Click and enjoy. Viel Spaß!